May 11, 2023, OSBI releases a statement regarding the ongoing investigation in Henrietta, Oklahoma. It reads, the OSBI serves as the lead criminal investigative agency in Oklahoma through partnerships with other federal, state, county, and local law enforcement agencies. With original jurisdiction and limited crimes, the OSBI is jurisdictionally available by request to our partners for assistance in various capacities, including investigative specialty services, partial, and full investigations. On Saturday, May 6, 2023, Okmulgee County District Attorney Carol Iskey requested the OSBI provide full investigative assistance and assume the lead role in the continuing investigation regarding the homicides of Holly McFadden, Tiffany Guess, Michael Mayo, Riley Allen, Ivy Webster, and Brittany Brewer at the hands of Jesse McFadden. The OSBI and our law enforcement partners recognize there is tremendous amount of information being publicly presented from a variety of sources as it relates to this case. In tragedies such as this, when families and communities are grieving and looking for answers, the rapid flow of information, and in some instances, speculation, can lead to misinformation being widely disseminated. Since the misinformation can be a distraction to the families and friends working to navigate their grief and may compromise the investigation as it moves forward, the OSBI does want to furnish the following facts to help provide some clarification and prevent the further spread of unconfirmed information. Since May 6, 2023, the OSBI has been communicating with the involved families, working to keep them informed on the progress and priorities in this case, and tirelessly processing items, conducting interviews, searching additional locations and property, and obtaining intelligence and documentation. Many of the investigative efforts have occurred with the support of other law enforcement agencies, including the Grand River Dam Authority, the Okmulgee County District Attorney's Task Force, the Office of the Chief Medical Examiner, and the Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco, and Firearms. The investigative process is ongoing and will be lengthy, but it is an attempt to determine what led up to and occurred during this incident. The work is also to discern whether there are other potential victims or suspects not yet identified. While OSBI is aware there is information circulating that does not represent investigative facts, we will not attempt to address each aspect of the miscommunication. Pursuant to Oklahoma Statute 74 OS 150.5 D1, OSBI investigations are confidential and the OSBI cannot release detailed information regarding investigations to the public. This helps ensure the confidentiality and integrity of each investigation. As we move through the investigation, the OSBI will continue to consider all available information and will conduct additional investigative activity necessary to evaluate information veracity. Anyone who has information relevant to this investigation may call the OSBI tip line at 1-800-522-8017 or email tips at osbi.ok.gov. Those providing information may remain anonymous. OSBI understands that at the culmination of this investigation, there will be many facets of this case that will need to be addressed. Some of those are not under the purview of the OSBI, but for those that are, we will attempt to address them within our statutory guidelines. Future official updates regarding the progress of the investigation appropriate for public release will be provided by the OSBI or the Okmulgee District Attorney's Office via a subsequent press release or on the official OSBI sites. Going forward, OSBI will continue to work with the family and our law enforcement partners as we will look for greater understanding. We ask for the continued support of the family and friends of Holly, Tiffany, Michael, Riley, Ivy, and Brittany.